we're going to talk about Patreon for a little bit. Uh, the link is in the description. This is the part where it's going to be really weird for the people who read the description before the videos, which, to be fair, is not how you're supposed to do them, because I never write a description. I write a description for the people who have finished the video, which is not how you're supposed to do it. Um, so, let's talk about money again. I have been very broke for the last two months, and just because I recently came into money, I'm not so stupid to think it's it's solved. Like, I'm not dumb enough to think, oh, well, that, that makes everything okay. Um, I basically, the money I've gotten between the GoFundMe and from relatives after this Black Friday sale, I'm probably just going to pay for my rent and then put the rest of it away because it's only a matter of time before my car breaks again. It's already got a problem where it likes to smoke whenever um, I drive too fast, which is a lot. Um, so I anticipate, especially with winter coming up, I anticipate having to fix my car again, especially since it just likes to come at the most inopportune moments. Um, but yeah, it's the bottom line is I've been thinking about this for a while, and I'm actually going to give props where props are due. Um, John Barnett was actually the one who commented and suggested this. Um, I was looking at different YouTube subscription op op yeah, options because I can technically do paid content on YouTube, but when I looked further into it, there was only, uh, you can only do two options. You can do a monthly option or a yearly option, and you could either turn your channel into a paid channel or make like paid content, and that was the only way to like make it work. And I, I thought I could do a workaround where I just made like one free video that, or one video that just said, hey, thanks for supporting, and that's the only video you could, a video you could only see if you paid, but it was clunky and I didn't like it. Basically, I was trying to set up the equivalent of a Twitch subscription, but I wanted more options. Um, and turns out Patreon was exactly what I was looking for. And the reason I didn't look at Patreon right from the start is I always thought that was a thing just for artists. Um, like, I'd never really looked into it. I thought it was just a way for people who, like, you know, do pretty good drawings or different, var like, various reasons. Like, I've seen it associated with webcomics a lot. I've seen it associated with artists a lot. So I just figured that's what it was for. Um, but to me, it looks like a monthly kind of Kickstarter format, if that makes sense. Um, and from what I've set up, I like the idea of what can be possible with this. So, um... This is going to be like a separate video later on. I might just cut it straight from the end of this video, but I thought I would at least throw it in ahead of time. Just if you're watching, you get a little sneak preview, I guess. Um, so the idea is, you know, I I try to put consistent content out. I know some weeks it's less than others, but my heart really is in it, and that's not a joke. I really, really do love making videos. I like the performing aspect of it. Like, I like, you know kind of getting to play up a little bit. I like playing. I like, and more than anything, I like the community aspect. I like streaming and interacting with the chat. I like um, interacting. I love reading comments and stuff like that. It's, I, I honestly love doing YouTube and can't imagine when I stop doing it. Um, but at the same time, real life carries on. Um, you know, bills still need to be paid. I'm still going to school, so I can't work as much. I'm still going to work. And if we recall when I was working a lot, even though I was making more money. At that point, it was just to pay off my fucking car. I, just, I can't believe I made the most money I've ever made last summer, and I also paid the most I've ever paid last summer, just like bills and shit. Um, so adulthood sucks, and if there's any way I can get extra money, I it's been tough because I don't want to, you know, hashtag sell out. I don't, I, I think, is that what the kids say? No, I don't want to be that guy. I don't want to be a shill. I I like doing what I'm doing, and I'm, you know, I have the like yearly um, anniversary streams, and I make uh, some good money from that. And you guys always are really generous during that. But at the same time, I I don't want to feel guilty about just putting the option out there. Like fucking nothing is gonna change if nobody decides to, you know, donate to the Patreon. Absolutely nothing. I will continue on as normal. The only point of this is to just kind of make things a little easier for me. Like if I'm able to get like 10 to 15 dollars a month just on top of everything, that's that's helpful. That's all. It's just I've especially I think it was like 
early this month. It was after my car broke down again, and I was and I just barely had a little bit of extra money saved um, after paying rent and car insurance, and I immediately threw it to that. Where it was like two weeks in a row, by like Tuesday, I had exactly like a dollar in my bank account, like seventy two cents in my checking and like a dollar in my savings. But that's not it's it's not something I've done in a while, but I mean I used to do that a lot, like especially um when I was younger. It just it's half of it's not being very good with money. I've gotten a little bit better, I think, but and half of it is just, you know, not a lot of money coming in. So my idea is that I want to at least put the option out there and I would be very grateful if people donated. If they don't it's okay. I honestly, you know, I don't blame you. That's not me reflecting badly on myself. Um, that's me of like, you know, it's by not, by nothing changes if you don't donate. By the same token, not a lot, or by the same other side of the same coin, not a lot changes if you do. It's purely a support thing. But, um, you know, I'll go through the, the motions anyway, and I'll explain how it's going to work. So I've set up uh, one, two, three, four, five, six different tiers, or I'm sorry, seven different tiers that you can choose from on Patreon. And I named them after Digimon stuff because I'm a smart marketer and because it's funny to me. So the first reward is called In Training. And it's just, you like my content, you don't mind giving me a little bit a month, it's just a dollar a month. Like just a dollar, that's it. That's all, I, that's all you gotta do. The next one up, <laughs> I was. I thought this was the funniest one I've made. Is a uh, rookie. You like my content and don't mind giving a little each month, but you're also offended that the first tier was called in training, and you won't settle for anything less than rookie. So it's two dollars. That's it. It's just two dollars. If you're some kind of crazy big wig and you can go two, you can spend two dollars a month instead of one. Then there's rookie for you. So the next one up. Uh, you're a really dedicated fan. You watch almost every video. Show up to as many streams as you can, and you really want to support me. It's like all the excitement of a Twitch sub with no emotes, so none of the real excitement. Thank you, though. Your name will be listed with the other champions and above in a monthly thank you video to all Patreon supporters. So, champion is $5 a month, which is equivalent to a Twitch sub. Yeah, Twitch sub, which I, th you know. Uh, I put the option there. I'd be much happier if I got 10 people to donate $1 than if two people donated $5. Like, in my head, that's better somehow. Um, but yeah, and, uh, if you become one of those champions, uh, then at the end of every month, I will do like a thank you video to all the people who are, or to the Patreon supporters. And I'll personally list out the names of every champion in the video. So it'll be like, uh, it'll show like donators and then champions and all the names and stuff. In a perfect world, I would also show the rookies and in training. But I needed like an incentive to do champion over the other ones. I don't know if people don't care. Like if you if you don't really care if you make it in your name or if you're yeah. If you do want to see your name appear and people who paid more don't care, like they just want to donate slightly slightly more, then I can start including everyone. But Patreon is very adamant about trying to make different rewards for different tiers, or they were very heavily suggested it so. Figured I'd give it a shot. Uh, then there's Ultimate. You're a big fan. You not only enjoy all my my content, but you truly want to see me succeed. You're the type to give kind words and are the big reason my channel has come this far. Uh, it's the same as uh, Champion, except um, your name will appear at the end of every video with the other Ultimates showing your support. So not just like a thank you at the end of the month, just like a quick like two second thing at the end. This was made possible by, and then a list of all the people who donated. And that's $10 a month. Um, then there's Mega. Honestly, I didn't want to put this category, but how fucked up would it be if I didn't put Mega? What is this, the first 30 episodes of any season of Digimon? And then I didn't write this, but except for Gross Wars, because they break the, the rules and don't believe in progression. Same reward as Ultimate, but you'll be list listed in Megas instead of Ultimates, and will feel slightly stronger than everyone else. I should have wrote better. That's funnier. And then uh, this is a kind of special one, uh, because it I like the idea that you can limit how many people can do one category so I called this one the Digimon Emperor so for tw if you pay $25 a month which you shouldn't um, you were the Lord over everyone else there's only one Digimon Emperor 
so only one person can have this one. While the rewards are the same as Ultimate Mega, you can sit on your throne above everyone else knowing you're better than them. I will call you the Digimon Emperor in comments and during live streams. You'll also have a guaranteed spot in any Jackbox game stream if you want it. And you can kick Wormmon, and uh, no one will stop you. So, I thought that that'd be a funny little gimmick. Um, I don't expect one person to just continuously pay $25 a month, but if there is no current Digimon Emperor and someone wants to just throw down $25 that month and then cancel, there's still a Digimon Emperor for a month. So, uh, I thought that'd be a funny thing. And then I would, I would absolutely call them the Digimon Emperor in streams and in comments and stuff like that. And I think the uh, guaranteed spot in a Jackbox game is a decent reward. So, um, yeah, it's. I thought that was a pretty cute reward. I don't know if anyone's going to donate it, but I thought it'd be interesting. I kind of wanted to put like a stretch type goal too, um, one that was like higher than the rest, but I don't really expect anything from. Which is also where this next one comes in. <laughs> this is the last one. Yggdrasil, King Dra in parentheses, King Drasil or the D Digimon God, has everything the Digimon Emperor does with a feeling of godlike superiority. Make a tracked virus that makes you want to rule the world. So, exact same thing as the Digimon Emperor, but it's for fifty dollars instead of twenty-five. There should never be an Yggdrasil. All right, that is absolutely the goal that no, like I don't want people to reach. Don't do that. Um, but it's there nonetheless. So, I'm gonna take a drink for a second, collect my thoughts. So yeah, I wanted to throw the idea of like constant support out there. Um, so if you guys think it's interesting or if this is something you can see yourself doing, I would be more than grateful for just a dollar a month. Like, or, and this works too, I would be entirely grateful for nothing a month, but you continue to watch the videos and continue to comment and be just all around great people. Um, so yeah. If you guys have any questions, uh, etc., this is going to be a separate video at, after, too. But for now, here's a sneak peek, I guess. Um, the link is in the description. It's just patreon.com slash Um Yeah, I don't... I'm honestly not expecting much because um, I just asked people to donate to the GoFundMe or said they could donate. I, I don't know if I asked. I said they could. And I just had the four-year anniversary, but... If you want to sh like show like a monthly support type thing, or you know, this is the way to do it. But I'd be grateful if you could at least take a look at it. And as always, if you don't like the idea of a monthly subscription, but you still want to support, there's always switch twitch.streamlabs.com/rathofzalus, which is where you can just donate directly. Um, yeah, that's it. Um, just wanted to get the message out there. Just it's a thing. Do with do with it what you will. Um, yeah. So thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for putting up with the hashtag sellout like all the kids say. Um, but that's it. Thank you, and I will see you in the next video.